Hey, what's up? I was having a passing thought. And it's about Carlton Pearson. Um, his life, his legacy, and what he is leaving behind, what he's leaving undone and incomplete. As far as the role that he plays in getting us to think about what we believe and to be better in providing insight, clarity as it relates to what we believe. Um, I think his part is complete. However, the work is not complete. It's not over. And I just wonder how many of us will complete our part in the whole of what must be done not just in the particular industry that your gift got you stationed at and working but as it relates to the world I look at all of these postings that are popping up on TikTok and IG and YouTube of another reformer, Reverend Ike, and how he was demonized and his work and his doctrine, and now he's being praised. It was prophesied to me that what I do, what I teach, and da da da, that I would never receive the recognition that's proper that somebody else echoing me will be the recognition that I receive. If I'm receiving that as a word from the Lord, it sort of does look like the pattern of everybody that is great. You always have your audience who is going to invest in, be great brand advocates for what it is that you're doing in your lifetime. You're going to have the support and everything you need in order to accomplish it. But a greater reality may be that your greatest impact may be after you close your eyes. <clears throat> if that's the case, I'm okay with that. I'm, I'm okay with that. My other concern around Carton that I have, that actually Carton situation is sparking, is me. <laughs> And what I'm doing and what I got to do and how I thought prior to now, I've always been very intentional, worked on purpose and doing everything that I do for a specific reason, looking at the long haul, not the short term. But this makes me become, it sparked the concern of, of how intentional am I? So I'm actually becoming more intentional in what I say, what I post, those I converse with, those that I share my time with, because we're, he's only 71, I think. That's really not a long time, and it's really not old. It's really not. I'm 45. What's that, like 25 years? That's not, it took me 20 something years to get to where I'm at. Um, and in some instances, it took all of the 45. So that's really not a long time. But I think we should all look at what we are doing and our why, as well as our how. Our how could actually be fucking up our timeline a little bit. Um, I really focus on that. Oh, oh another thing. Because my mom also has a cancer diagnosis. Thanks be the goddess only stage two and she's already responding to one lump just disappeared after one um, chemo treatment <clears throat> so she's doing well and she's about to be 70 this year well in a, the next year she's 69 now um, you know we're not here always we, we ain't we're not here always so I think once you look in the eyeball of death, which I started doing about a year and some change ago, it really caused me to start living. I think we maybe should think about death more in light of 
it inspiring us to live on purpose. I thought about how I've been so work consumed that I'm really not enjoying my life, but I've started to change that over the last year and a half. And I hope that you guys will do the very same thing. And if you see online where anybody is disrespectful to those that have blazed the trail, am I saying the trailblazers are perfect? No, I'm not perfect. I'm a trailblazer. You're not perfect and you're a trailblazer. But when you see them disrespecting Bishop Carton Pearson and Reverend Ike, and some of our were other great black cultural reformers. Don't let that don't let that ride. Just like y'all fight down there for Beyonce and Obama and these folk you do not know. And maybe not even impacted you spiritually. <clears throat> maybe. I need for you to fight and 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 go all the way left. Go totally off. When they're disrespectful to Reverend Ike, particularly Bishop Carton Pearson, because I saw that in my chat. I deleted those people and I prayed a special little prayer for those people that were coming in my chat and talking sideways and off about a man who is transitioning out of this experience. I'm like, this, you think this is the time? You know what somebody told me? And I have to be careful because I know this inf inside information. But do you know that some people have been making an, an argument that it's very important because of Bishop Carlton Pearson's doctrine that they go to his bedside and ask him to accept Jesus as his Lord and Savior. I just hope that it slips out out of somebody's mouth that person and what they said. Because when they do, you're going to know that it's public because I'm coming up here and I'm going to go line by line. People are horribly disrespectful. Let me say this. Bishop Carlton Pearson never ever denied Jesus Christ. So why? Why would you make a statement remotely similar to he needs to accept Jesus as his personal Lord and Savior? I just because he don't believe in hell? Because he put his arms around the LBGTQAI plus community and embraced Bishop Yvette Flunder and her wife, who we all love and should embrace because they they gave us thank you, Lord, for that's Yvette Flunder and oh happy day. That's her wife. Yes, you should respect them and put your arms around them with no judgment. I uh Oh, I don't know why Christianity is so mean. Um, I surely don't believe in hell. Hey, hey, how you know I'm becoming Dr. Vanessa? Yeah, I mean, but I'm. But why does that even matter? I mean, I don't, I don't even know why they, why it matters that much. We make these doctrinal things more important than humanity. And the true measure of our spirituality is how we engage as humans. Let me repeat. The true measure of our spirituality is how we engage within and surrounding humanity, ours and others. I don't care what, what you're saying and how powerful you are and what you're able to do with your gifts. If I inspect your humanity and how you sit with your humanity and how you engage and interact with others, and I see moves that Jesus wouldn't do. <laughs> I mean, your your faith, your religion, your practice means nothing at that point. I believe if, if we're going to have a religion, now I still say that I'm a Christian because it's my calling. I'm born for the word reform. So it's my calling to reform some things. So I want to deny the church and deny Christianity. However, I will say this, that I understand why people do not want their brand or their name or their work associated with the um, ancient organized religious institution called the Christian church and its Christianity. 
I get it. Be because of this kind of stuff that be going on. On IG, TikTok, Facebook, and YouTube. It's really embarrassing. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to make this statement and I'm going to get on. <clears throat> if I would go by a different religion than Christianity, I would go by the religion who that man that said love is my religion it's about Marlon that's what my religion would be it, it would be love and when love is the, the faith practice when love is the the way that you live it is the thing that determines how you speak, how you engage how you teach, how you preach I think I think I think we have to shift the way that we do certain things. I think if love is our religion and we're gonna wear that as our religion, we have to make some shifts. But ain't Christianity supposed to be a a faith founded in unconditional love? Oh my god, we got that all forrooked to the high heavens. I think the Christian church has taken over the Christian belief system and practice and just imputed upon it and imposed upon it a whole lot of things that just don't line up with Jesus. I think Jesus is just the mascot that is used by the Christian church. Their product that they're pushing and it's the consciousness of Jesus Christ, the idea called Jesus Christ, the code of conduct called Jesus Christ, they ain't doing that one. They ain't doing that one. All right. I love you all. I'm at my appointment now.